Hey guys, it's Sean. Okay, so I'm going to quickly um, tell you what I um, want you to know. And that is, this makeup look inspired me. Um, the inspiration I got for this makeup look, I should say, is from the movie 300. Um, it's one of the Greek gods in it, um, Xerxes. I think that's the name of um, the character. Anyways, the gold and the winged out or the um, eyeliner, how it is, is basically how it's worn by the Greek god in the movie. And then, um, yeah, the brow color, the um, your brow bone color, that I um, brought in myself. I think it looks nice for this. And the um, same color that you're going to use on your brow bone, I brought down just underneath my eye. And then I did a little bit of a white... Um, eyeshadow just under my eye and in the corners a little bit not too much and um, then I lined my full waterline lower waterline right up and then right down and to connect the top um, eyeliner right down with the bottom so yeah I personally think that this look could be used for a New Year's party if you were to go to one um, and if it's too dramatic for you, what you could do to just tone it right down without um, changing much is take away the um, extended eyeliner at the end, and it'll make it look a little more sophisticated, I guess you could say. Uh, but I don't think you really need to take it away because New Year's, it's a new year, try something new. I don't know, I think it's nice and fun and... Yeah, and then I just added a highlight to my brow, um, just underneath my brow, eyebrow, and uh, yeah, so that's basically all that I did. If you want a tutorial, just let me know in the comments below or send me a message. Um, you can also request other looks. Um, the reason I'm asking you for requests is because for Christmas, I'm just going to let you know, I got the 13-piece brush set. I'm just going to let you know right now. I do not like this brush. I like every other brush in this collection that I have, except for this one. It's way too rough, and I don't know. I think that they should add a different brush into their 13-piece brush set to replace this one. Um, but that is also why I got the Italian Badger fan brush. Gets into these good areas right in here and just to wipe away that excess powder or shadow that falls out and it'll just brush it away. I think it might be a little bit too soft because it just glides over those little um, fallout areas but I think it's worth the money. This was only a couple dollars, I think. Um, but yeah, and then on top of that, I got the Silk White and the True Black Gel Liners from Coastal Suns. I love them personally. I use the, since I don't have a um, primer for my eye, for the eyeshadow yet, I use the Silk White. I just took a little dab of it and just rubbed it all the way over my eyelid and then right for my, just up to my brows, considering I did use a highlight so it works really good um, I've had this on for about 45 minutes to almost an hour and it still looks the same as it did when I applied it um, so yeah if you want a tutorial on this look just let me know and I will do that um, these are a couple of the um, colors that I can use this is the 26 color shadow blush combo palette from Coastal Scents that I got um, then I have the 88 Warm Palette from Coastal Scents. All these nice colors. This one has shimmer and it's all mixed together. But, um, yeah, just an idea of what else you can um, request to me to do for a look. Um, that. And then here is the 88 Color Eyeshadow Palette, which is the most popular one from Coastal Scents, I'm pretty sure. And that's this one. Now, this is the one that everybody says that it doesn't have shimmery colors, when in fact it actually does. It's basically the whole left side here. Sorry, the camera's probably flipped. That's why you're not seeing the left. You're seeing the right side. But this whole left side here is more matte colors. And there is actually quite a few shimmery colors on this side. And I think they're really, really good. Like a couple of these goldish brown colors have shimmer 
um, the oranges, some of the silvers, even this blue down here is quite shimmery too. So I guess it's just a matter of opinion on whether or not you consider these colors shimmer. Um, so yeah, um, those are some of the colors that I can use, plus um, a couple of the other colors that I already had prior to getting these before Christmas. So let me know of any looks that you'd like me to create, um, and I will attempt them for you. So I hope to see you guys soon. Um, I love you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing to me, and yeah, I will talk to you in my next video. Quick addition, um, I'd just like to let you know that I created a new channel, which is The Haunted City. I'm not going to be using that channel anymore. I decided that I'm going to just stick with this channel because this is where all my subscribers are. I don't want to have to drag them all over to my new channel. And plus, um, I have no real reason other than I hate my username. Um, so, yeah, you can expect um, tutorials and everything, reviews adventures and all that stuff on this channel except I'm going to be dividing them with um playlists dividing them into playlists like makeup adventures reviews and stuff like that I will add those playlists as the videos for them become available so I will see you guys in my next video thank you love you Mwah.